Oh, that's why that. They must be. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I had a very productive meeting with President Biden. Uh, President Biden and I held for. Oh, I see there's a whole rally here. So I can't compete with it, I guess. Um, President Biden was very gracious, very open, very friendly, and we had an open and frank discussions. And the most important thing out of this discussion is, of course, the commitment of President Biden and the administration to work until January 20th, until the last minute, to achieve goals that are so important to peace and stability and predominantly security and security of the state of Israel in the Middle East. First and foremost, there are various frontiers that we know. One is Lebanon, one is Gaza, of course Iran, and the entire effort of how to change the trajectory of the Middle East towards a better future. I thank the President wholeheartedly for his efforts, and I know that there is an in-depth commitment and effort to move forward and I hope, sincerely hope, that we will see certain results in the foreseeable future, in the next few days, hopefully, in, with, in some of these efforts. So thank you all very much. Shalom Rav. Lavo Kadima. Families of the hostages, sir. Sir, any message to the families of the hostages? Did President Biden bring up humanitarian aid to Gaza, sir? Thank you. 